Tori made us some tofu scramble. Yes, I did. How did you make it? Um, I cut up mushrooms, bell pepper, zucchini, onion. Put that in the pan with some tofu, nutritional yeast, onion, garlic powder, salt, pepper, turmeric, and mix it all up. And then put it on the toast. <laughs> There is a life I lead in this city Hurry in to cup my tea I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart moves slow Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am holy? Take me back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling but the feeling is all gone okay. We went to Native Foods which is like a Be vegan together. restaurant And we got a bunch of different things we were going to try I want it all. We got cauliflower dippers With buffalo sauce on it and vegan ranch Mm, that smells so good. An oatmeal cream Oatmeal pie. cream pie. Look how big it is. Yeah, that is really it's good. Massive. And a vegan chicken burger with a side salad. Are you ready? Yeah. Or oh, on this. It's called hot, Nashville hot tofu. Mm. <laughs> okay. Mmm. It's good. <laughs> this I have high hopes for. I honestly have, I don't think I've tried a vegan oatmeal cream pie. I think I can envision what that tastes like. And if it doesn't match, I'm gonna be confused. What do you think? I love it. That's exactly what I was envisioning. <laughs> it's so good. That's the best. Mm -hmm. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. <laughs> so I'm gonna um, impulsively interview you right now. Okay. You've been living in the van. For like about a week. <laughs> How do you feel? I feel amazing. <laughs> this is what are my dream life? The pros, the cons, the ups, the downs. Like what? there are no cons in my in my eyes. Really? Yeah. Even like going to the bathroom outside, I feel like that's a pro because when I look down, I'm able to see like <laughs> little crystals on the ground, and <laughs> yeah. I'm connecting with nature, and I like that. I don't see any cons. What about the lack of consistency and structure? I love that. I'm very, I like change a lot. So. I love that. I can get really um, weird. My mood can be kind of weird if I don't have enough change. So I think this is perfect for me. Mm -hmm. Constantly keeping on the go. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I love that. <laughs> what about you, Sarah? <laughs> what do you mean, what about me? <laughs> How's it been having me in the van with you? Mm, okay. Are you needing any alone time? What's no. going on? It feels <laughs> weird doing this in front of the camera. <laughs> but, <laughs> um, no. I, th I think we actually do really good with getting alone time. I feel like we both kind of take that space naturally. It doesn't even have to be mm -hmm. sad. We just kind of like, Go on a walk or like we're right into I don't know. we are, yeah. Is this what you expected the trip was going to look like and living in a van would look like? I will say I don't think I had many expectations coming into this. Mm-hmm. But um I'm pleasantly surprised with how everything has turned out and it's been really easy and I haven't I think one thing that is one thing I was worried about is not having enough alone time but it's felt so perfect and easy. Yeah, have you had enough alone time? Yes, I have. Because I can tell that you understand when I like walk if off If you or go something. off, yeah. And, yeah, yeah. And, and I'm not like, that. yeah. Yeah, no, it's been perfect. I actually like when you take alone time because I also need that, but I feel like I just want to be around you. So sometimes I don't prioritize it, but when mm. you do, I'm like, okay, good. This is what we both need. 
Mm. In a way. Yeah. Perfect. We should just move in together. <laughs> yeah. So that <laughs> so she's moving in. <laughs> That's your favorite, huh? <gasps> you dropped it. I'll still eat it. Good. <laughs> just just a little bit of hair, dirt, bird poop. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Mm. What's your favorite? I guess the sandwich. Really? It's growing on me. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favorite thing about living and traveling with me? And what is the most challenging thing about living and traveling with me? Um, my favorite thing about traveling with you is how, well, there's two things. Can I do that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's being, you can do many things for being this one. <laughs> in nature so much and being, yeah, just being immersed in nature and also getting to know you on a deeper level. What'd you say the worst thing? The most challenging, ch challenging thing about living and traveling with me. Um, the most challenging thing has been that it gets really cold at night sometimes. <laughs> that has nothing to do with <laughs> traveling with me. I don't have one. Yeah, you're right. There's not really a challenge you make it better. 100%. Tell them something. Get away from me. <laughs>
I want him to come <laughs> over here. There's her. <laughs> Try to justify your loss. It's fine. But I'm still going to win. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.